Welcome to this lesson. This is called circumference of a circle. So to find out the circumference of a circle, we use the formula as follows. And our formula is going to be circumference, let's try that again. Circumference equals to pi multiplied by diameter. Now pi in this case has a symbol such as this pi and that stands for roughly 3.14. So pi stands for 3.14. Now you don't need to know how we call pi or what it is but all you need to know is that uh, a math mathematical formula has always and has been provided for us and it stands for 3.14. Now in your scientific calculators, if you're using a scientific calculator, you can always press the shift button and then the pi button, and that will automatically create the 3.14 in your calculators. Now, what's a diameter? A diameter is a measurement all the way across inside of a circle, doesn't matter which way around it is, from one end of a circle to another. You may get a question that asks you a radius. Now a radius is a measurement from the middle of a circle to the end of a circle. Now remember our uh, formula is circumference equals pi 3.14 times diameter. You may get a question where you may only have a radius, which means that you need to double the radius and then multiply it by pi, okay? So that's how you work out these questions. A diameter is anywhere in the circle from one end of the circle to another, and the radius measurement is from the middle of a circle to an end of a circle. And please do remember this formula, pi times diameter is the measurement of how to actually work out uh, circumference of a circle. Now here, in this question, we've already got the diameter that's been provided for us. So we're just going to work out pi times diameter to work out the circumference, and that's going to be 3.14 multiplied by the diameter, which is six centimeters. And we can work this out now to give us the answer, which gives us the answer of roughly 18.8 four centimeters, which is going to be option C in this case. If you have a, a radius, for example, then you will do it slightly differently. Let's say, for example, uh, we have a question and we have a radius that's only been provided for us. And let's say the radius is two centimeters. So in this case, what we're going to do is, we're going to use a slightly different formula radius is going to be two centimeters and we need to work out what the circumference is. And remember the circumference is the measurement all the way around a circle. So the circumference means the measurement all the way around the circle on the outside. In other words, how much does it measure? So for this, we're going to do pi times radius times radius. So in this case, it will be the case that you're going to do two multiplied by two times by 3.14, or you just double the radius. So double of two is four. So we know that two times two is four, four multiplied by 3.14. And that will then basically give, which will be around about 12.56 centimeters. So the measurement all the way around this particular circle, so all the way from here, all the way there, again, this is the circumference, is going to be 12.54 centimeters. Okay, so either way, you'll get a question based on diameter or radius, and you use these formulas. Good luck with the rest of these questions. Thank you.